they are getting a, such a divorce. She's gonna marry Oscar. They're gonna have automaton slash human cyborg babies. She's oh, this is how a cyborg from Teen Titans was born. She's his mama. It all makes sense. Booyah! Yeah. Silver Child Gamma. Thank you. Random name, but thank you. This is gonna be random, but is there a backstory for Cyborg from Teen Titans? Like, do we know why he's a cyborg? I think he was in a new movie, I thought. Oh, I have no idea. Like, his dad was doing experiments or something, and something happens where he got, like, messed up. Dad did the experiment on him and made him cyborg. Huh. Well, to the extent, I'm probably wrong. So was it they an... Know. Would it be an accident, or was it on purpose that he's a cyborg? A little bit of A and B. Ah, oh, shit. Well, his dad was fucked up, if that's the case. Well, no, he was gonna die, so we saved him doing it. No, this is me, Christ Senpai, is unleashed the DSP, thank you. Appreciate it. Fuck I. Everything okay? Love. Yes, Kate Walker. I am waiting to continue our journey. He was in a car wreck, he got Oscar, fucked up, he got fucked up, it was a car accident. It's probably a car missing, accident. I'll... Everything is ready. He merged Take with the seat, car. Kate Walker. We are leaving. I'll... <laughs> Okay. Oh, so he's pretty much Bumblebee. He used to have an Farmer? Afro? Yeah, the Transformer. Because Transformer Bumblebee is a car, right? Yellow They're car. all cars. Ah. Oh, yeah. That was the main concept of Transformers. <laughs> they were cars. I don't. <laughs> I don't know a lot about Transformers, okay? I was never a Transformers kid. I was a Beast Wars kid. Of course, cry. All black people used to have afros. Jesus Christ. Wow. Some were planes, that's true. Some Transformers well, were planes. The fucking Autobots, they're typically all cars. Oh. Which is what Bumblebee is. I knew he was a car. Fuck yeah. I have other Beast Wars fellow brethren with me. Thank you, everyone. Be strong. We'll be together in hell. Buff is still famous. He's just, you know, Shia LaBeouf. He got in a car accident and the father was working on alien metal and nanomachines and tried to fix him, but the nanomachines absorbed all the metal around him and slowly started to adapt. What are you At doing first there, he looked Oscar? like a huge metal thing, it is then to that become a robot. With railroad and custom it's always nanomachines. Fucking nanomachines. Oscar, don't you think we could drop the trifling details once and for all? We need an exit visa to get beyond the wall, Kate Walker. <sighs> and you wouldn't know where I could get one of them from, would you? There is usually some form of authority stationed at a guard post that is strategically positioned to issue such a visa. Okay, see you later, Oscar. Yes, Kate Walker. Oscar is pretty much the character that drives this story. He's the driving point. And the train conductor. He's my best friend. Nunia! Thank you for unleashing DSP upon us all. God rest his soul. I always see Cosmo's right, and I keep thinking it's actually Cosmo. I know. I think he does it the fuck with everyone. Of course he does it the fuck with everyone. He fucked with me once. 
Got me confused. Jerk. Why are 12,000 people watching us? Well, sincerely, Liz. Siberia is a crowd pleaser. No, it's not. <laughs> Hello? Hey! Look how you're so oh, dumbfounded by that. What's going on? Well, I finally got the mechanical train wound, and I hope it's going to take me to Hans Varlberg. I want whatever I sort things provider out she has. Weirdo sailors, and really they probably reception. rip me off. But now, I'm locked behind this massive wall. Yeah. You should see it, it's huge! Maybe they're all in tennis. I'm not talking about that. <laughs> I want to know what's going on with Dan. What do you mean? Oh, that big ass turbine. I bumped into him at Maggie's Do, and he said you'd can argue. Can we bring dancing Snoop Dogg that's back? A bit over he the can top. dance right on top of the two on G2. He's got a bit the last time we called, that's all. No need to go overboard. I don't mean to be Miss Melodramatic, but he didn't seem in such great shape. He had his down in the dumps head on. <laughs> like Dan has a down in the dumps head. Well, yeah, when that shock of hair flops over his forehead and his Coco, eyes bro. Up, Thank you. And his eyebrows My name really flows together. well. I'd never noticed. Maybe I did go a bit too far, but he's got such a goody two-shoes image of me that sometimes I just lose it. And this case is taking up a lot of headspace. I was just looking for a bit of compassion. Well, you sure got mine. So, what's going down? Like I said before, I'm kind of getting somewhere, but it's slow. This Hans Vorlberg guy is getting more and more fascinating by the day. Okay, well, anyway, it doesn't sound like you're bored. Not like back here in the office. Every day is boredom day. It's just no fun without you. <clears throat> when are you coming back? Shouldn't be long, I hope. Look, I've got to go. See you soon. Well, call us again real soon. And be easier on Dan next time, huh? I'll try. No, Dan needs to be easier on us. Dan's a fucking asshole. He's selfish and doesn't understand we're on a job. Yeah, just wait till later. No point. Fucking Dan. Flame stab, thank you for unleashing DSP. And scaring Cully McLaughlin. The fuck is his name? Cory McLaughlin? Macaulay Culkin? Macaulay Culkin. What kind of fucking name is that? McCulkin. It's like a bird. Oh dude, telescopes. If you look through there, you'll see people changing. Last person he was a part of her. Good day to you, sir. Colin McClellan. When I first played it, I did not notice that guy over there. Oh, I didn't even notice him either. <laughs> what the Militia. fuck? Commander in he chief blended of the in. <laughs> border post at your service, madam. I was so confused. I thought she was talking to herself. I need a visa to cross the wall and to continue my journey to the east. They told me that you are the only person in a position to issue such a visa. Indeed. This responsibility is part of my duties. However, I am not currently issuing visas because nobody must venture beyond the wall. The wall. And why not? It's far too dangerous, in particular for a lady of your standing who is traveling unescorted. Dangerous? What exactly do you mean, Captain? The enemy, miss. The oh. enemy. I've been observing them for several years through my telescope. There's one particular horseman stationed yonder. He's a scout from the invading enemy army. And he's been spying on us. So I have to be extremely vigilant. He knows that, was a really that good I know he's there, Thanks. you understand? Well, and as long as I keep my eye on him, he won't dare try anything. Are you sure? Please. Take a look for yourself. Dude, I wonder who the enemy is. Don't mind me if I retire, Captain. Please, madam. My respects. He blends in too well. Doesn't help that his friggin' coat. Is that a dragon? It's a claw. Or a man on a horse. Is that? How strange. Or a log. I can't no. see a Cossack horseman at all. There's just I a can dead see tree it. in the middle of an empty plain. I can see. That I can see the head of a horse. Have a really bad eyesight. And a flamingo. Yeah. 
Yeah. I don't know why, but that's how me and Cheyenne talk randomly at times now. Oh, okay. It just happens naturally. Look! Broken glasses. If they belong to the captain, then he sure has eye problems going by those lenses. So he needs to get new glasses, and then he will see that he is not being attacked by the enemy. Lalo's left shoe! Thank you, homie. Kinky kitty kiki. <laughs> Kinky kitty kiki. Thank you. A lot of K's. I like it. It, 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 like, it works, man. Thanks, Queer Master. Damn right, let's do this. Don't, don't you fucking agree with him? <laughs> I don't know, after how we woke up this morning. Oh, God. Colonel, sir. Captain. Yes. But you have the air of a great officer. Uh, you flatter me. Unfortunately, I am afraid that we frontier soldiers are often forgotten by the military administration. Oh, there's no justice. I sympathize with you, Captain. Let us forget our worries for a moment and have a little drink together in the name of friendship. She's trying to poison him. Uh, it would be my pleasure, miss, but the regulations strictly forbid it. Come on. A little glass of wine never hurt anybody. She's trying to kill him. Wine, miss? You are putting me in a very delicate situation. Don't deny yourself, Captain. Just a little glass. I assure you, it is excellent. Well, perhaps just a drop. And now you know it's the hotel guy. Wait, what? The same voice as the Here's your guy glass. at the hotel in the beginning. Your good health, Captain. Oh. And to yours, miss. He's going to die here. Oh, he drank the whole glass in one swig. Wow. He's a man. That is impressive. That is a baller. One drop, whole glass. Mm. It's been a long time since I've drunk wine in such pleasant company. I admit, it is excellent. Now kiss him. Isn't it? Give him you wouldn't kiss. think it came from Barrickstadt. It is made from the Amazon Forest Sauvignon Grape that has been miraculously conserved and cultivated in the station garden. Well, well, well. The university authorities kept that one to themselves. You know, Captain, it is essential that I continue my journey eastwards. Please, don't even think about it. As I've said, it's extremely dangerous. The enemy is spying on us. Perhaps your Cossack horseman isn't quite what you thought. Perhaps it's just a dead tree twisted into a strange shape. You should take another look. You never know. Go on, Captain. Give it a try. So be it. I will make this concession to the fairer sex, miss. But it does seem to be quite ridiculous. I want a hat like his. He, he looked at it through his forehead. Incredible. How is this possible? By what strange magic? How could I have been so wrong for so long? The enemy was only a tree. I'm so ashamed. It's not that bad, Captain. It's only human to make mistakes, after all. A tree. Nothing but a dead tree. Pull yourself together, Captain. It's okay. And now I suppose there's nothing stopping you from issuing me a visa? Yes, of course. There is no more danger. All these years. And now the Cossack has gone. There is nothing left to watch. Captain, you should be delighted. From now on, you don't have to stay pinned to your watchtower. 
travel can start up again normally. You will be able to resume your regular duties like issuing entrance and exit visas. You are right. I will sign you a visa to cross the wall frontier immediately. A thousand apologies. Here, miss. So, he was kind of loopy, man, because, like, he thought I was a tree for years, or man, man was a tree for, <coughs> a tree was a man for years. Thank you, Captain. And keep your eyes open. His but glasses like, are broken. Uh, miss, but, but like, if we could he thought it keep didn't this between move ourselves, once please. for years. For the sake of my honor. Yeah, he's you also understand? pretty stupid. <laughs> you have so. my promise, Captain. Don't let everyone know I'm big old Dumbo, please. Thank you, K Walker. Bye. Five minute warning. Five minute warning. You know what happens in five minutes? Game change. Please be moving. Explodes! We're all gonna die! Isn't Amen. that a fucking Madonna song? What? Five minutes. Something. I Madonna, know. Justin Timberlake. Fuck do I know. Someone on now. Dude, imagine if you had the active knowledge that the world was going to explode in five minutes, what would you do? Not masturbate. Yeah, I can't <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just get one out before going. And one? When find well, shit, I guess you're right. So much yeah, adrenaline, rapid you'd fire. probably go like, yeah, just spurt, spurt, spurt. Like a goddamn then... machine gun. Yeah. Oscar. Then you find out it's like, oh no, it's gonna happen in five years. But like, oh well. Okay. Just another See you night. Later, Oscar. <laughs> yes. It's <laughs> just another. Night. <laughs> Here is the visa. I hope it's regulation, my dear Oscar. Hmm? Hmm. It is regulation. Here is your ticket. Whoa. Have a good journey, Kate Stop Walker. finally. So, can we go now? Indeed. We are already very late, Kate Walker. <sighs> Dude, we're leaving the college. Fucking finally. Good job, K Walker. Here you go, Oscar. <laughs> Even bigger than Oni Chan. Just Thank you, Kate Walker. Now, please return to your seat, Thank you. Kate Walker. Yes, Oscar. Immediately, Oscar. Dude, she's starting to fuck with him, man. She kept saying Oscar because she was toying with him. Because he, he, he keeps saying K Walker. She's got a sense of humor. I like that. You know who else has a sense of humor? Who? Uh. April Ryan. And Zoe. Oh. Zoe Castillo. Alright. Yeah, but Ryan is the main character in Longest Journey. I know. Zoe Castillo is the main character of Dreamfall. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, it's the next main character. You gotta follow him, man. Finally leaving this goddamn place. Salute her! Salute! Do it! Oh. oh, there's the little thing he thought was a little bad name. Is he gonna push it? Yeah, dude, check those graphics, man. Really push it away. Hell. 
making progress. Fucking doing it. Finally. Dude, we got 40 seconds. Pizza Dude's got 40 seconds. See? See the reference? I made a reference. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tip the Pizza Dude if he's late. That's what Michelangelo said. Yeah. Someone hit the ads. Because they... I didn't hit ads. People oh. are getting ads. John, did you hit ads? No. I didn't hit ads. I can check who hit ads. You sure can. It wasn't me, I swear. I'll check as soon as 10 seconds are up. I can check. It's in Ten. your dashboard, right? Yep. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Out! This guy times it so perfectly. Done. Yeah, pretty much. Alright, who the fuck ran ads? Gonna go look right it now. May have been me? Did you run ads? Did I didn't mean to. Did you do it, bro? Did I? Did you do it? I'm gonna I find out. I didn't mean to. I'm gonna find out right now. I'm gonna find Quit out. Quit yelling at me. I'm gonna find out. Don't accuse me. I'm gonna do it. Alright, let's see. Activity log. Russ Am Money! I Russ oh. Money ran a commercial team. When I went to go ago. focus on the window, I accidentally you hit it. You motherfucker. Ah, <laughs> oh, well, everyone who got an ad. Sorry. Right, I'm out of here. He missed Sorry, clicks. I ruined everything. <laughs> he ruined the whole stream. He's out. He left his, He <laughs> left him speak. He's gone. Cry on mobile ads play randomly oh, he's, automatically oh, he's gone. times. Really? That sucks. Mobile blows. I'm sorry. Ugh. And I really wish I could have gotten the thing to put it so subscribers don't get ads, but Twitch won't freaking do it. I've been trying to get him to do it for two years now. But they're like, no. You don't get that because you weren't here early enough for it. Like, that's dumb as fuck. Like, freaking Dan's Gaming's got it. Lethal Frag's got it. I think Lethal Frag's got it. Either way, it's a bunch of doom freaking stuff. Hate it. Whatever.